Hey, welcome to the behind the scenes for Homemade Spider-Man Homecoming. Action, guys! So we've done Spider-Man a couple of times on homemade movies. This one is a little bit different, so I wanted to update the suit and make a new one. So I have a red shirt uh, and a blue long sleeve shirt. Using a piece of charcoal, I sketched out the red shapes onto the red shirt. I'm gonna cut those pieces out, and then I'm gonna put that over the blue shirt so it creates the layer. Now that I've got the two layers on the shirt, I'm gonna draw all the details on with a Sharpie. I got some blue leggings. It's gonna be very, very form-fitting. <laughs> uh, we'll see. <laughs> now we do have the mask that we made and it looks pretty good. It doesn't look like it's been updated. So I'm gonna reuse this so I don't have to make another one. And then I got some red gloves and some red socks at a 99 cent store. All right, Ryan, don't, uh, don't break your neck. Nice, that is some good car jumping. I feel great, I feel good. Ugh. Okay, the silly string is not really working, so we're gonna try some paper on a wire. To play Tony Stark, of course, is homemade movies Tony Stark, Dustin McLean. All right, he gets it. So we went down to Mashable to shoot in the office there. Now Dustin, of course, has the Iron Man suit that he's made, so he's gonna be wearing part of that, and then there's a war machine in the background, and Dustin already made these for his Civil War trailer that he did, so check that out. What, Spider-Man is war machine? Two people. What? Can, right? <laughs> <No>! <laughs> and action. On the roof. Cool. <laughs> and Ryan is totally blind. Uh, hello, someone there? They leave me again? I'll help you. I'll help you. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Peter Parker is much taller. <laughs> uh... There are people that handle this sort of thing. <laughs> And then we're gonna shoot some stuff in my car, and it's gonna be the daytime, so we're gonna cover up the windows with some black sheets and uh, make it work. Ready for a road trip? Is this Uber or Lyft? <laughs> it's very windy, so we've got John and Avi over there helping out. Baby, make it nighttime real quick. <laughs> it's also very hot in the car. The ATM scene was the one that I was really looking forward to making and the funniest part about this is the cheap looking Avengers masks and so who better to make those than Mark. <laughs> it's like the Burger King King. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Plug time, got these rad masks that Mark made, and I'm gonna let you guys fight over who's who's. I don't know. <laughs> I'm all of them! I wanna be them. the Hulk! I got Iron Man! People don't know this, but in New York, there are no numbers on the ATM machines, it's just 10 boxes. Friendly neighborhood Spider Man shoots behind the scenes. Hi, everybody! These aren't the real Avengers. They may look like it with their guns and their ATM machine, but don't be fooled. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> yeah, you wanna see it? <laughs> <laughs> that looks pretty great. Mark is unbreakable. He's the Hulk. Are you Tony Stark? <laughs> yes. You don't look like Tony Stark. I shaved. Oh. So we've got Deadpool standing in for Spider-Man upside down. Mark is holding the Deadpool head. And then Ryan is actually standing next to Mark and he's reaching his actual arm down to be the Spider-Man hand. <laughs> Action. Uh, uh. Tangled up. <laughs> so we just finished shooting the ATM stuff with everybody standing upright. So now we're going to lay everything on the ground and have our actors lay on the ground and I'm going to shoot it from above so it looks like he's upside down. <laughs> Action. Great. 
Here we have our Coney Island beach setup, Ferris wheel way in the background, and that's actually the Captain America shield with some Christmas lights on it. It's nice out here. <laughs> kind of smoky. Yeah, Coney Island's um, on fire back there though. Ah! <laughs> We're doing the vulture shots and Mark made the wings out of cardboard. This is gonna be wings. We're making wings. I can smell them. Um, the helmet is a motorcycle helmet we spray painted black and put some neon eyes out of construction paper on there. And he's wearing Star-Lord's chest piece, actually. For this shot, Mark made a 2D backdrop with a hole cut in it, spray painted it gold, and drew all the details on. And then he made a tiny scale vulture with some cardboard wings and some of those finger raver lights that we have. We've done Spider-Man before, and so we have a mini Spider-Man, and he's pretty articulated, so we're just shooting a bunch of miniature shots with him. This is a pretty elaborate setup that we have here, where we have a helicopter in the foreground, so I have it attached to a PVC pipe, which is attached to a tripod, and then the ground is some sheets that I laid down, and we've got some army guys and some Hot Wheels and stuff. So Mark is operating Spider-Man, and he just pulls on the strings and his arms open up. We're looking up at the wreckage of the ferry and so I made some cardboard pieces with some straw details to create the underside and then I've got to shoot this straight up because there's G.I. Joe's standing on the top. So we have our sky clipped to the ceiling and I'm shooting from underneath. Here we have our broken Staten Island ferry set up. I actually used some storage baskets to make the pieces of the ferry. Spider-Man is set up on a wire and then we use some yarn to create the web. What? How come Robocop's not helping? <laughs> you may notice in the way background there, our Statue of Liberty is actually our Columbia woman from the Columbia logo, so reusing her. There's really not much else that happens in this shot other than the water flowing, so Mark is going to be operating the smoke machine to create like a water effect. The final shot of the trailer, we've got Iron Man and Spider-Man flying through the cityscape. So we made a cardboard skyline, some cardboard buildings, and I have toy Iron Man that we've used many times, and he is on some fishing string. Yeah. <laughs> and then, of course, our Spidey is on a coat hanger. Spider-Man's going to spider school. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, oh, friendly God. neighborhood Spider-Man. If Iron Man is Tony Stark, the logic... God, why do you always treat me like a kid? God! <laughs> Mark, you get to keep those. What? <laughs> These are going over my room. <laughs> ah! Ha! <laughs> That was scary. So these aren't blue, but these belong to my wife when she was 16. I think they're quite stylish. I'm bedazzled. And here we have uh, Spidey modeling a uh, summer spider suit. Good for crime fighting and jumping. Great. And that's a wrap on Spider-Man. Ow! Woo! Woo! All right, we go fight crime. All right, see you later. <laughs> and that is how we made it. Thank you for watching. Make sure to check out those links below to see our video as well as the side-by-side -side comparison with the original trailer. Don't forget Homemade Movies, first Tuesday of every month, so subscribe to Cinefix. Oh, wasn't me.